Konnichiwa! Sean of Izuno Ken Studios here, and welcome to episode number 3 of the Yu-Gi-Oh! Mega Content Opening. This is the $300 set that I had ordered. Of course, per the video, I will be taking a slight hiatus from the Duel Links videos to accommodate all of these. And I'm very, very, very excited to open these for you all. So, I really am proud and happy to open these right just for you guys to enjoy please like favorite comment for you know engagements and please subscribe to catch all the latest hit that notification bell for more future videos and thank you for watching in advance so now we got specialty sleeves we got purple with some white here of course we have some penny sleeves to boot some clear penny sleeves we got a couple black and white and in the middle there's a few gold ones just in case I find some really cool ones hold on let me get the yeah we go and um here's some green so let's go ahead and get this cut and I will be right back okay everybody I'm back and I got the little box open now prepare to prepare to see a very large episode and I will be expecting to be filming this from off the stand that I have right now. I have a macro stand right here. So, as you can see, we got the bubble wrap and the cards inside. Oh, 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 oh. I don't want to see it. Don't want to see it. Don't want to see nothing yet. But, we got one, this binder here. And then, oh my goodness. We got a big, fat ass binder here. So, all together that makes two. So let's start going to get this a little more a little more organized for you guys. Okay everybody, now prepare for this big opening. Now as you can see we have this big old fat ass black binder here. And this really tiny little um white pro S binder here. So yeah we got yin and yang. So we're gonna go ahead and open the inside first. We're gonna start on the left. I'll save that open. Well, so we have some classic cards here. Hold on, let me get something and kind of rig this up. So, and as you can see, we have some cards that slide out. And oh, wait a minute! I just say a lot of cards. So, Trap Master. Oh, these must be all the copies of Trap Master that they have. And it comes from different sets like Starter Deck Yugi, Starter Deck Kaiba Evolution. Okay, it has some really cool ones. So they're separated by the actual card, not necessarily the set. So we got a lot of Saber Beetle, 2000 Needles, Tenkabito Shien, like two packs of those, Trap Masters. We got Skull Invitation. Got a gold sleeve right there. Oh my goodness. Okay, um let's get that in order. Okay, that's that's a little better. Battle Scar, they got Beast Soul Swap, Bubble Crash. So these are like some trap cards real quick. German Trio, or do have a Traveler. Yeah, let me just go ahead and back this up just a little bit. Just a little bit, a little bit. A little bit, a little bit, one second. Sorry about all that. I just went ahead and got it um, straightened out for you guys so you can see both the pages. I was kind of saying, okay, I got Staunch Defender, of course, Time Seal. Very iconic card here. Spellbinding Circle. Got Toon Defense, which is very good. I think it's like a dollar now. Um, you got Armail, Aquamador, Seven Color Fish up there. Got um, Darkfire Soldier number one. I think Darkfire Soldiers number one and two are worth quite a bit. And we have Darkfire Soldiers one and two. But two is kind of messed up a little bit, but that's okay. So again, it looks like the common cards, like common monster cards and stuff like that. And they're um, sorted by alphabetical order. From a... Ooh, Mask of Brutality from Legacy of Nightmare. No, Labyrinth of Nightmare, sorry. It's Legacy of Darkness. Okay. So we got... Absolute End, a Japanese Crush card. We got Kaminati Attack, which is pretty cool. That's worth about $1.99 now. We got some really nice cards. Like Super Robo Yaro. We got Just a Break, Labyrinth of Nightmare. We got, um... Some... Cool spells and traps and other cards. These are all sorted by, um, I kind of, mm, some are sorted by 
Alphabetical order, and then there's just some like thrown in here. Magical Thorn, that's an old card. Macrocosmos is worth about a dollar still, even in common. Sasuke Samurai, Ring -ku Ling Winged Kuribo level 10. Excellent card to have. Elemental Burst, I remember when Jaden pulled. No. No, he yeah, Jaden did pull this out in GX. I remember. Fudin Kazan, that's nice. Fairy Box, that kind of card. Dice Reroll for. Your fans of Gamble Decks. Destiny Board, which is from Dark Beginning, too. Nice. I guess with about a dollar. Bristinatrix, Avian Sparkman. These are from the Lost Millennium. Um, Frenzy Panda. Funny card. Fayaro. Fira Yaro. Ooh, Go Gaga Gaga Gigo is not in good repair. I'm sorry. Yakutana Magami. That's always a cool card. Guy out of Fierce Knight. Green Phantom. Yeah, Green Phantom King over here. Gradius. Oh, this is some Judge Man. Harpy's Brother. I finally got another one of those. Put it in the Harpy's deck, even though it's not necessarily part of the Harpy archetype. They put it in there anyway. Because Harpies are pre predominantly women. With the exception of him. Ooh, Moki Moki. He's worth about, like... He's worth quite a bit. Moki Moki's like a dollar or some odd change. U.S. Master Kyun Chi. I remember when Vivian pulled that card out. And where's one and two? Ooh, got two. I'll put that in my zombie deck, maybe. Cool normal summon now. Uh, Nico Gal. Ooh, Nico Gal number two from the tournament pack. Nice. So they do have some tournament cards in here. Uh, Ocelo Hero 2. People running about. Pharaonic Protector. Uh, that's that's a proxy. Perfect ultimate great mob. That would be a proxy. That's sad. Robotic Knight, Ryukishi. Okay, got Rubber Lady. Rubber. Skull Dog Maron. That's another one. Red Eyes Black Dragon. But these are all well, predominantly like the true cards. Sleeping Lion from Tournament Pack Six. Nice. Try to fan through these real quickly. The end of Anubis is the proxy. The Uzi Jim Thousand has idols so about a buck twenty nine. Oh my good! Oh 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 oh! Stop! Yep, pull it out. Try the hell. Another one. I'm so glad that I got a first edition as well. That is amazing. Let me get a. That by itself is eleven dollars, and it's a first edition too. I'm very glad to have that. And, yeah, it's in great condition, too. Great, 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 great condition. Let's see if we can put that back in here. Okay. Trial of Hell. Excellent, excellent card right there. And the that was before the errata. Oh, my God. And that's not all of it. Flip over here. I got another pre-errata card. After the Struggle. That's like $5 there. So, if you have, yeah, I already have $16 in my commons right now. Just between Trial of Hell and After the Struggle. Abyssal Designator, which is pretty cool. I like it. Big Wave, Small Wave is the um, proxy. Boss Rush. Book of Secret Arts, Chris of Fiend. There are a lot of gems in here. You just gotta go through them. But yeah, it's just a lot of cool cards for a lot of things in here. Fuma Shuriken. Glad I had that one. Earth Champ. Glad I had that one too. E Emergency Call. That's a uh, pretty um pretty pretty card. Pretty nice card too. Griffin's Feather Duster. Hammer Shot is a proxy. Invigoration. It looks like a proxy, but I don't think it is. Luminous Spark. That's worth about two dollars. Um, we got the second sarcophagus here. Back this up just a little bit more. And there we are. The third sarcophagus, the second, and there's probably the first one in here too. So cool. We got Umi Ruka and Umi. We got Wasteland. We got all types of cool cards in Force Out Lady Morgan Doom, Magnet Circle, Mage Power. Some pretty cool cards in here. Metamorphosis right there. That's pretty awesome right there. I got a metamorphosis. Ooh, Pot of Grief from Starter Deck 2, which is a very, 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 you know, worth it card. It's actually 
it's actually up there in the value, like two or three dollars. Ritual weapon, sadly, is the um, that ritual weapon is sadly the proxy. Sorry about that. Soul absorption is up there now. Second coin toss. Soul of the pure, but it would have been better if this was a um from the tournament pack. Ooh, we got White Magician Piketu and stuff like that. Shadow Tamer. Wall of Illusion. Versago the Destroyer from the, tur from the tournament packs. Nice. Tadpole. <laughs> Put that right there. Rottweiler, Witch Doctor of Chaos. Got plenty of scars. Plenty of Spirits of the Pot of Greed. Steamroads, Vampire Orcus. The Bistro Butcher. The Unhappy Meeting, which is a very short print. The Unfriendly Amazon. Forgive me. Okay, Vampire Lady. Nice. Got Getsufuma, one of my favorite cards ever. <laughs> oh yeah, these are all just like sort of Granadora. They got Hysteric Family. I mean, Hysteric Fairy. Hysteric Family, oh my goodness. And I have a White Rabbit. And um, we got Koitsu. Karate Man. Yeah, from... Yeah, that's from Starter Deck Joey. King of the Skull Servants, I think that's worth about quite a bit. Lord Poison. Manju with a Thousand Hands, that's still worth quite a bit. Mystical Sheep number one from Tournament Pack 5. Magic Scient Magical Scientist, that's worth quite a bit now, too. A Magician of Faith, Manithro Trail. <laughs> well, I got quite a decent set of cards here. You got Grand Ninja Grandmaster Sasuke. You got uh, Poison Draw Frog, Princess of Sudagi. You got fucking a lot. I didn't mean to drop the F bomb, sorry. Regenerating Mummy, <laughs> Red Eyes Black Chick, before it was Arata. Sonic Bird, which from MRL Magic Ruler. Skill Dark Magician. Steamroid, you got Soul Purity in Life. Skullmark Ladybug, I'm finally glad to have gotten one of those. Solar Flare Dragon, Sword of Flames, Time Wizard, Suijin, Down from the Amazon, the Dark Hex Sealed, the Unhappy Maiden, the Rock Spirit, Thunder Nyan Nyan, Tsukuyomi, which by itself is about $1.20, Thunder Dragon, which went up in value, um, we got, wow, we got a lot, Vampire Lord, that's, a, that's one of my favorites, right there, Vampire Lord. Wandering Mummy, White Magical Hat. I've always thought this card was cool. Break of the Magical Warrior. Magical Warrior. Jesus. Bulganian. Black Stego. Got Beazle Frog. Cliff the Trap Remover. Got Cyber Arc Fiend. Cobra Man Sakuzi. Cobra Jar. That's $2 right there. Cyber Ogre, of course. Decay Commander. Got Don Turtle. Destiny Hero Doom Lord. You got some Destiny Heroes in here. Oh boy. Got um, Dummy Golem. DS Frog. Or Does Frog. Dimension Jar, which I think is worth a bit. Um, Bubble Man from Duelist Pack 1. I think that's worth about close to a dollar itself. Elemental Hero Wild Heart from Elemental Energy. Got Enraged Muka Muka. Over here on the far left, I'm not sure if you can see it. Right there. Got, um, Flying Sauce and Musiki. Finally, got, I got one of those from my Alien deck that I make. Giant Orc, Goblin Great. Nice, nice, nice. Very nice. And how about that Trial of Hell, though? That I got in the very first set here. That is amazing. I was not expecting to ever get that card ever again. But I'm glad I did. Oh my goodness. Hold on, let me fix this. Now that was awesome. That was an awesome opening so far. Now, I have a feeling that we just got quite a bit of our value worth back in this little... Well, it's not little, but it's a binder all the same. Now, this one will really... I have a feeling that will really hold our value. So... Let's go ahead and take a look into it. Put that back there. And, wow. Got quite a decent setup here. We got 
Floodgate Trap Hole, Utopia Ray 5, Black Dragon, Mrs. Radiant. They have Mileage Radiant and they have Mrs. Radiant. And that's it. Oh, oh, oh! Pretty, pretty, pretty. Let's take this out. Red Eyes Black Dragon from the Battle Pack 10. Wow. Pretty card. Worth quite a bit. About $12. About $12 for this card right here. Ooh, I'm going to put that back. Yeah, the, anything from the Battle Pack 10s, they're sorted out by, there's like 12 or, yeah, 12 different cards. There's like one Battle Pack 10, which 2002 came with six cards, and a Battle Pack 2003 came with six cards. You can tell which ones came from the 2002 sets, 2003, because the 2002s are 1 through 6, 2003s are 7 through 12. So, ooh, yeah, lava going, but it's not too good to repair. BS Tetrin, Guardian Sphinx from Piranha Guardian. Blacklisted Soldier. I should have had this one in, like, a booster pack. I should have had that card in, a, in some booster pack. Total Defense Shogun, Imperial Order from Pharaoh Servant, a secret. Nice. Iron Dragon Level 5 here. Ooh, it's a proxy. Got Relinquished from Starlight Pegasus, Curse of Dragon, Scapegoat, Slate Warrior, Acid Rain. Got quite a. Ooh, why? Nice. Spellbinding Circle from Magic Ruler, BES Tetron. Adhesive Explosive, this is the Ultra. Demise. No, it's the Ultimate, sorry. Got Demise, Flame Wingman. So Magic Cylinder, Lord of D, the Legendary Fisherman, which I'm glad to have, Pharaoh's Servant, excellent card. I'm going to Sparkman, got Uriah from the Tin, got Stardeck Yugi's Dark Magician, got Destruction of Destiny, which is an ultimate. Ooh, Black Skull Dragon from Metal Raiders, ah, but it's in poor repair. Damn. Princess Pikeru, though, that's an ultimate. Started at Kaiba, Black, White, Blue Eyes, White Dragon. <laughs> black, White. But, um, got Chathonian Alliance, Dark Rumor Nightmare, Red Eyes Black, which is about $5 on its own. Siyari, Sphinx Salea. Got the Collection 10 Raviel. Oh, and the Chathonian Alliance is actually an ultimate. Ooh, Millennium Shield. We got two Kaibas of Relinquisher. Dark Magician Girl, excellent. Collection 10 2. Jump promo, Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. We got Restructor Revolution, Delinquent Duo. Act of Despair, of course. Dark Core, Dimension Hall. Contract with the Abyss. Miracle Fusion, Limited Removal. Oh. Is that it? Guardian Trice. Shiningen, Purple Light. Hero of Purple Light, right here. We got Dark Fire Dragon, which is worth a bit. Ojama King. Worth a bit as well. Got Curse of Darkness, Cyber Summon Blast, Skull Mutation, Rising Energy. Got, ooh, Meteor Dragon, Metal Guardian. Got some McDonald's cards in here too. Trap of Border Racer. Okay, so I have After Struggle and After Genocide, which is excellent. Got Shining Angel, both from Magic Ruler. Yeah, these two in the corner there. The Legendary Fisherman from Dark Beginning 1. Send you the Thousand Hands. Cyber Jar, three copies of which. Rao, we got Cat's Ear Tribe. I think it's $2. Jalago, Dark Dryceratops. We got Theba Nightmare. Ooh, Vanity's Ruler. Nice. Wind Creeper at level 10. White Magical Hat over here on the right. We got Arm Dragon level 5. Thunder Giant, Rampart Blaster. Performance of Sword. We got two copies of Wing Karibo here. Forced back. Amphibious Bugroth, which is a McDonald's card. Flame Swordsman, another Dark Fire Dragon. We got Dark Balls with a Terrible. We got Phantasmal Martyr, Spiritualism. We got quite a bit of cool cards. Flute of Summoning Karibo. That is two that's a two dollar card right there though. Yeah, we got quite a bit of cards and quite a bit of good stuff in here. Ooh, I didn't mean to throw it like that. But yeah, these are, yeah, I got two binders full of excellent cards. Excellent, excellent cards for that. 
I think any collector would be very fortunate to have. So, I do hope you like this video. Please like, favorite, comment for interactions. Please share and subscribe, of course, to get all the latest. And please hit that notification bell, too. I'm sorry for hitting that camera. But anyway, this is Sean from Izanokin Studios signing out. Have a great day, everyone. That concludes this video. Thank you for watching. Sayonara. Richinchiro.